And we are back with our number five of uh, F Plus Live. Uh, wait, no, not F Plus Live. 24 Terrible Hours. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've done this intro right once yet. Those Nailed it. Two different events. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, just a couple of uh, notes right on the top. Uh, in the uh, top right corner of the stream, uh, you're going to see Frank West playing... Uh, Red Lake it looks his really tottery, good. His tottering man is jumping on rocks. <laughs> it's really good, really good game. Uh, and then in the remainder of the screen, uh, you're going to see some uh, delightful drawings. <laughs> delightful drawings uh, from Travis. Uh, also, uh, on the stream, if you are on uh, thefpl.us, if you were fortunate enough to get in, uh, we have a battle going on um if you uh leave a donation comment of sing uh then you are voting for our next block to be f plus sings uh if you leave a donation comment with rap uh then you are voting for uh the f plus raps yeah, uh, currently what happens if there's a tie that's impossible no i'm not even uh, <laughs> it, we just do kid rock uh i, I just have to do something really <laughs> look, quick look Look, here's what here's what we've learned so far in this in this live stream. You don't need to worry about these kind of things. <laughs> It'll all basically work itself out. <laughs> it's inverse Murphy's law, yeah. Mm -hmm. Sponsored by Dr. Dick. Um, I just gave the, the listeners an umbop. They need another one too, so here it is. Okay. I hope that one's quieter. <laughs> yeah. All right, yeah, so we are at $1,500 and 69 cents. Uh, Sing is only slightly in the lead with $151 and 69 cents. Sing really came back. Versus uh, Rap at 138.43. Why would it be uh, sideways? <laughs> uh, that's, uh, oh boy, this game looks shitty. Um, uh, yeah, so uh, this is uh, this is our five. Uh, and uh, our five is called Not Always Learning. Uh, we got oh, Achilles Healy no. is back in the room. We've yeah. We've also got uh, Adam Bozarth. Hello, Adam Bozarth, who said to me, out of my voice. He said to me uh, about 20 minutes ago, I got drunk at yeah. an office party, so you can forgive me anything. <laughs> yep. Hello. Oh boy. That's exciting. Uh, we still got John but, Toast in the room. Hello. Is anybody else not drunk? Uh, not quite. I mean, no, I got no, I got to pace myself, man. I got oh, a lot oh, of hours yeah. left. You pace yourself. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm I'm a little buzzed, but it's only noon for me. I I think I'm coming in hot. Sorry. <laughs> I think I'm pretty much there too. Hello, and that, John. Uh, and that other voice that you're hearing there, <laughs> that is Cheapskates. Hi. Oh, hey, Mbop again, I guess. Uh, <laughs> and Cheapskate, uh, you gave us this document called Not Always Learning. Can you tell me just a tiny little bit about it? All right. Uh, you may remember our episode from NotAlwaysRight.com, which is improbable stories of uh, customer service employees showing up idiot customers. <laughs> this is the sister site, which is improbable stories of students uh, showing up teachers, principals, authority figures, bullies, and <laughs> other things. Fantastic. Other things that totally didn't happen fantastic okay great uh yeah so uh in the uh schedule that we'd set up uh i have this hour off uh so boots you're running this one okay uh, awesome. am i supposed to be here yeah hi lou hey hello is this when i'm supposed to be here i don't know <laughs> who cares come on in yeah that works Let me join you join us for be, voice because yeah. we got travis sticking on for the art so. Yeah, All yeah. right, I'm gonna draw two just for my own entertainment. <laughs> okay. I can only right. handle two streams at once, so <laughs> just on your doodle pad. Um, yeah, so so yeah, lemon's going off for a break. Uh, we're doing not oh. always learning, which was, I believe, Achilles Healy's choice. Yeah, Ooh. I just like true stories. On the internet, so <laughs> true <laughs> stories. Um, yeah, we all we all like true stories. And yeah. uh, let's start Achilles. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give you this. Let's see if that link actually works. These docs are, are very old. Uh, yeah, it does. Okay. Um, uh, you are... Are you high school? <laughs> Saskatchewan? <laughs> I Hello, I am, <laughs> well, I am high uh, school. I am high school. I can read the description if someone wants to... Who wants to be teacher? I'll be teacher. Uh, yes. who, who's, oh, yeah. who's student? Uh, Lou, you're the student. Oh, sorry. Mm. Okay. Oh, I'll wait. be student? Okay. <laughs> Lou's the student. Lou who's is the student. student. Who's the student? You're the okay. narrator. Well, who's me or in an entire class? <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, I, I, well, you're me because you're also the narrator. 
And oh, Adam sure, Bozarth yeah. will play the role of the entire class. <laughs> I'm going to play yeah. the entire class? Yeah, okay. 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 Uh, this is my story. It takes two from high school in Saskatchewan, Canada. This is an exam slash test tests extra stupid students and top. So I've been put into a few advanced classes because of my grades, which is cool. a little awkward for me because it involves being placed in a class of students from the grade above mine. I'm painfully shy around people I don't know, and I've often had people remark on the fact that I say almost nothing in class unless specifically asked. We have just been giving details about just been given details about an upcoming exam. Okay. This exam will have two questions for you to answer covering two topics you've studied this year. Saskatchewan accent? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so only two topics are actually going to be assessed? That's right. It could be <laughs> anything, so make sure you study. But how do we know what to study? Are you going to tell us the top what the topics are? I stare at you for a moment. <laughs> <laughs> no. So we just pick two topics and study them? Yeah. And then you fail because you picked the wrong two. Seriously. How am I in this? Oh, I'm sorry. That's you. <laughs> <clears throat> Rescinded oh, yeah. everything I just said. <laughs> oh, yeah. Then you fail because you picked the wrong two. Seriously. How am I in the same class as you? Stares at me <laughs> for a few moments before bursting out into applause. <laughs> Good job, entire I, class. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I don't care if that was aimed at me. That was worth waiting all year for. One thousand three hundred and forty-three upvotes. <laughs> It was the best day at the GameStop you ever. <laughs> uh, moving on now, we've got a, a, a school story called Having a Ball with a Bully. Uh, are all of these in uh, script format? They, they should better be. be. Uh, yeah, they usually so... they are. Last time they were. Yeah. Okay. At game, yeah, not they, always GameStop it... they were. <laughs> yeah, they take the they take like the raw stories that people write into them, and then uh, they rewrite them uh, in script format in this sort of uncanny valley sort of English that they use that vaguely resembles human speech, but uh, not really. <laughs> great, great. Um, all right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna narrate a story called "Having a Ball with the Bully." Uh, it's from a high high school in New York, USA. Uh, cheapskate, you're gonna be an obnoxious <laughs> classmate. All right. Um, I'm going to be me, and I guess that's it. Can you read the tags quickly, please? Uh, sure. The tags are bully, geeks rule, and students. <laughs> <laughs> of course. I'm fairly, uh, I am fairly well known as a kind of odd and geeky. I have been teased and mocked all my life for various quirks. Lately, I've figured out a method to deal with people being jerks. The classmate in question is a spectacularly obnoxious and has seen me playing Pokemon while waiting for class to start on several occasions. We are working in groups. Okay, I have to stumble repeatedly over the pronunciation of an Italian word, so... <laughs> Arriva Durki? Arriva... Arriva Dursi? Uh, me, politely. It's actually... Arriva Durchi? <laughs> this is great it is so I'm, really. I'm now angry and offended oh what do you know about it go buy an ultra ball and leave the rest of us to actually study oh, oh. actually I, I generally down actually I generally get pokeballs they're the most cost effective great balls and ultra balls have higher cash rates <laughs> but the increased expense is far higher uh, oh god ultra ball is twice as likely to catch true but six times as expensive meaning it's more effective and cost efficient to just buy six pokeballs for six times the capture chance and your response ellipsis <laughs> That's so, my response, too. Were all of these stories written in the Stalkiverse? Because <laughs> <laughs> they feel very parallel to comedy. Actually, yeah. I generally get quirky balls. <laughs> <laughs> it's my Stog as Garfield voice. 
<laughs> I keep my Pokeballs in a Pringles can. <laughs> So, uh, so up next, or she my Pokemon, you can't yeah. stop. Right. So the note says that I never bothered you about playing Pokemon again, and I actually think that's reasonable. I think I retired from bullying in triumph after he this. He never bothered me <laughs> again. Uh, this next one is called. Uh, I'll, I'll let I'll let you tell me what it's called. Uh, a toast. This one is called Revenge is Sweat. <laughs> you. <laughs> that might actually be intentional. It takes place in a gym center or a dance center. A dance center, yeah. comma gym. Yeah, it's very clever. Um, <laughs> okay, so uh, Lou is uh, instructor, and uh, Achilles, you'll be newcomer. Mm. And I guess that covers Here it. We go. Arm over. Oh, as you say, tags. Bad behavior, health and body, students, teachers, top. So, no bottom top. bitches in this story. <laughs> I am overweight, but have been losing weight through the Zumba dance program. I have been doing half hour classes and feel ready to start on the long hour classes on top of those. My Zumba teacher is delighted, but this one particular newcomer. Newcomer. <laughs> delicious newcomer. Mm, delicious newcomer. Mm, not so much. To you. Oh my god, you should not be here. This class hasn't even started, and you're sweating like a pig. Do us all a favor and get out of here before you kill us with your stink. Oh, uh, excuse me, but I just finished the half-hour class that just ended. If I weren't sweating, I would be worried. Uh, liar, you probably can't even dance. You'll just drag everyone down, so get out of here. In this gym, we accept any and all who want to live a more fit life. <laughs> no, Dumbledore, hi. <laughs> whether, whether you think she can dance or keep up oh. is a moot point. She is just as welcome as you are. Now, get in line. Class is about to begin. I was doing my female voice. I didn't know. <laughs> uh, <laughs> since I have been doing this program for months, <laughs> I dance like a mad woman and push to the very end. The newcomer struggles with one of the faster routines and sits out only uh, after 15 minutes of working out. Yeah, that's right, fucker. <laughs> after everyone else finishes... Very good, everyone. Now, you all did a great job, whether you lasted for 15 minutes, half the class, or the full hour. Or, if you were kind of badass, like, brackets my name, and both did half an hour and the hour-long classes, she kicked some major butt today, even though some people thought she was going to waste our time. Would you like to say anything to the class, brackets my name, question mark? Five yes. points for Hufflepuff. <laughs> yes. Yes. I am a fat fuck But I can <laughs> honestly say that I am bettering myself and I work for my sweat. I may go home looking disgusting, but I can at least say that today I worked out six times longer than a person half my weight who decided at the beginning of class that I can dance. Everyone applauded, and the newcomer. Gra <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. No, you're too kind. And the newcomer grabbed her gear and slinked out. She never came back. One thousand. I made sure of that. Thirty-two <laughs> thumbs ups. For this. Yay! I shamed a woman out of exercising. I think I yelled over the boat. <laughs> Who cares? Yeah. <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> Well, that was just a lovely story. It's really, really nice. I'm nice glad you got we're, applause. We're all sort is of this, on side. But... Is this where you just go to share the time that you once got applause? Yeah, that usually that's that's what the internet is. I guess so. It's just oh my god, <laughs> this is the one time everybody <laughs> applauded me. I like Trav's drawing a lot. <laughs> Buff <laughs> Buffledore. I like Buffledore there. Yeah. yeah. Right. You brag about the one time you got applause, but it doesn't even use your name, so nobody knows that it's you except for you. No, it's your name. My name is your name. <laughs> <laughs> My parents hated me. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, uh, our next one has uh, quite an elaborate uh, dramatis persona here. Uh, it's called Playing Him Outed. Oh, God. So we got uh, mm -hmm. how many rolls? One, two, three, four, <laughs> five, six, <laughs> seven. <laughs> Oh my gosh! <laughs> Somebody's gonna have to double up. <laughs> okay. Oh god! Oh, I didn't even look at it yet. Uh, oh, so, oh Cheapskate, shit. do you want to take the narrator on this one? Oh my goodness! Oh, sure. Okay, and then let's just go. Uh, Bozarth is loud classmate. Okay. Uh, Lou is bigoted classmate. Uh, I'll be football <laughs> player. Uh, who am I forgetting? Uh, can oh, I be the cellist. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. He's... <laughs> Wait, have I forgotten anybody? I I'm the friend? Am I the friend then? Oh yeah, you're the friend. Yeah. Who's the other classmate? Uh, you're also other classmate. Sweet, also all right. Classmate. Where is the link for oh, this playing him outed? Oh, uh, it's, it's this one right here. Okay. So, remember, star means fuck. <laughs> yes. Wait a minute. Wait, uh, so if we... All stars mean fuck. Okay, yes. that's good yeah. to know. <laughs> yes. That's the rule. So this story is entitled Playing Him Outed. It's set in <laughs> high school USA. The tags are uh, bigotry, LGBTQ, musical mayhem, students, and top. Man. Are we going to get no power bottoms in any of these stories? Shit. Nah. We have joint orchestra choir concerts. We are standing in a hallway next to the backstage area. One loud classmate is being a blabbermouth and talking oh, to a friend man. very loudly. So loud. So did you know other classmate is <laughs> gay? He said not to tell anyone. Can you believe it? Everyone turns to look shocked. <gasps> You idiot! Everybody heard! You just outed him! The other classmate in question walks out into the backstage area and notices everyone looking at him. Uh, what are you all staring at me for? What? Well, a friend of the loud classmate and a bigot! Speaks up. <laughs> Is it true? You're a F. Fuck, fuck. Is that what he does? I can't remember. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's perfect. Perfect. Loud, perfect. loud classmate just said so. I'm not <laughs> singing with an F. Fuck, fuck. <laughs> Realizing he has been outed to everyone and fearing repercussions, the other classmate turns and runs to a bathroom and locks himself in. We all go after him. Including bigoted classmate, I guess? Bigoted classmate. Oh, Are you a classmate? Wait, no. is that me? Oh, sorry. Yeah, we have to be on in like two minutes. Leave the f fuck fuck alone. <laughs> However, another singer who is also a football player speaks up in defense of the other classmate. Oh shit, that was me. Uh, boots, that's you. Yeah, yeah, I think. yeah. yeah. You're the football uh, to the big of the classmate. F fuck 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 off before I beat the crap out of you. <laughs> <laughs> All 42 of us reach the bathroom where he has... <laughs> I'm sorry. Stampede of choir people. <laughs> yes, no, I, a bad people? I, a choir I know and how many people are in a group. I'm that good yeah. at counting. All 42 of us reach the bathroom where he has locked himself in, still holding our instruments. He, he, took, he took your instruments into the bathroom? <laughs> Naturally, we are fearing the worst. Dude, open it! It's fine! We're fine with you being gay! Don't do anything stupid! No, it's not! I told her not to tell anyone! Now I'm gonna be catching a fuck 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 from everybody! No, you're not! Dude, we don't care if you're gay! You can sing awesomely and that's all that matters! Now get your butt out here and let's go do the concert! And if anybody gives you trouble, I will personally beat them to a... <laughs> F fuck 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 pulp. <laughs> no, no, I can't. How do I know you guys aren't going to beat the crap out of me when I open the door? Everybody, one, two, three, four. Bop, 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 bop. All forty-two of us. All forty-two of us start doing our concert piece. 
right there in front of the bathroom door with the choir members singing and the rest of us playing. We can't beat you up if you're playing, now come out! The other classmate finally comes out, albeit tentatively, and everybody breaks into cheers and surrounds him, assuring him <laughs> that we accept and respect him however he is. We do delay the concert, but it gets underway again. The bigoted singer? He doesn't dare say another word. Our outed classmate, by the way, is now out of the closet and happily attending college. Woo! Oh, that's a, that's a happy story. Not for me. Yes. Everyone, I'm out of the choir now. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what's going to be he's just folded arms like Call what's going to be a a big classmate um, I think it might be a time to check in on Frank West because uh, that game is looking that very game, different oh, that, looks awesome. that lake is red man that is a terrible looking game that's a lake uh, yeah. Yeah, it's red lake hey Frank oh, West no. hey, hey jumping puzzle you, you're just in time okay oh, so okay, yeah. oh, good. everything about this game is the worst and I, I hate it so much <laughs> So if, if you look really closely at my screen right now, you might is see Wildlands. What is that? See, you might see a small floating blue sphere of particles that are the same color as the background that will instantly kill me and I can't kill it. Oh. But you have and, a gun. But yeah, you can shoot well, the barrels with fuel you, and something. You can't shoot spheres, that's a lie. That hint no. is wrong <laughs> and it also stays there forever. <laughs> the oh god, please no. Don't die what again. No. <laughs> well. Oh, the background changed color. What? I'm sure it's oh, significant. Oh, well, I can see the spheres. I guess. Sort you know, of. Frank, you're re you're reacting like this, but this is basically stalker. Oh no, <laughs> you died. Whoa. I'm you're so. Dying. So I got to this area because I, I walked what? up to a zombie, and then it the screen looks... went black. Gross. I'm just gonna just gonna put this over the stream for a second here. I got uh, got some artwork from Lou. Um, <laughs> he's, he's, he's multitasking here for us. Oh, <laughs> Somebody's not mad that I compared this to Stalker. Somebody's mad that I compared this to Stalker. <laughs> I mean, if you didn't tell me this was Red Lake, I'd basically think it was called Pripyat. Come on. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's pretty close, really. <laughs> okay, we're gonna uh, step away from Frank. Thanks, Frank. Bye, Frank. Um, and then back to the document. We've got oh, wow. All right. Uh, uh, More true stories. Healy's. I want. Yeah. I want you to to make a choice here. Ooh. Yay! Yay! Um, yeah. So the first one is titled "The Power of a Kenya Do Attitude." Whoa. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, and the second one is knows World War Two too much. Huh. Um, <laughs> I gotta go with that second one. Okay. <laughs> Seems relevant. Yeah. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, uh, so you're in uh, high school in Denver. Mm -hmm. um, we're gonna need a teacher here, so uh, that can be uh, Bozarth. Mm -hmm. Teacher, okay. You're the teacher. And take it away. All right. Um, I'm in a high school in Denver, Colorado, USA, and geeks rule! Also, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. also, history, movies, and TV popular students. Oh, right. this, I, I doubt this involves any popular students. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> there was a comma between those. That's there, a very were, important comma. There, were, there were commas. There were commas. Uh, I am meeting with my world history teacher for the first time in class. Okay, this class will start off with World War One and World War Two mainly. You know why? Because I think those are the most influential and interesting wars of human history. Is there anyone in here that knows the basics of either of these wars? I feel a grin spread across my face. I'm a fan of an anime that explains the history of the world with oh, cutesy characters. Oh, oh, you know oh, oh, this is oh, this better not be really Alia. Need... <laughs> Wait, is this not the applause? Um, oh God, no. <laughs> I raise my hand and answer. In World War II, the two main sides were the Axis powers, 
Germany, Italy, and Japan, and the Allied forces, Russia, China, France, England, and America. Canada was also part of the Allied forces, but they were invisible to the rest of the world and often not credited. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Boots. What's up, um, Booty? <laughs> Italy was the weakest of the Axis powers, basically calling Germany for help constantly. Germany! Germany! France is kicking my ass and Southern Italy is beating me up! Uh, I want to die. <laughs> <laughs> I want to die. Teacher? Oh, that was the sound of me blinking and remaining quiet. <laughs> right there with you. Uh, well, the I war ended after in the, the sound of Zorak blinking. The war ended after the Normandy landings in Europe and the bombings of Japan, with the official dissolution of the Kingdom of Prussia following not too soon afterwards. Class continues as normal for a little bit. The teacher hands me a note halfway through. See me after class. After class. Million years detention! <laughs> <laughs> no, sadly, the teacher said, You knew an awful lot about World War II. Nervously, yeah. <laughs> now the sound of computer sc showing a computer screen. <laughs> I'm guessing that you watch this oh, during your free time. Fuck off! <laughs> God. Uh, lo and behold, the computer is yep. pulled up to a wiki page on the exact anime the exact I was referring anime. to earlier in class. I was being so coy about which one it is. Turns you out mean the, the one that you mentioned. <laughs> Turns out the teacher was a huge fan of the anime too, and not and owned not only the DVD sets but several copies of the original uh, manga. Go to do, jail. You two deserve <laughs> each other. <laughs> like three people in the, in the chat. Just go to jail. Did you guys I look don't... at the comments? I don't know what I'm mad about. <laughs> the fact that that story was so fucking crazily fake, or the fact that I knew the anime he was talking about. <laughs> oh, I didn't even realize his comments on here. Mm hmm. Yeah. Uh, I, I am um... Scott. Yeah, I'm Scott Gano, and fascinating, most everything the me person said was wrong. Then again, they learned it from poorly done cartoons, so. <laughs> That's good. Oh Thanks, my God. god, there's comments on this website? Uh, and then Brian, oh yeah. Brian, Brian Goulet yeah. says, Really? <laughs> because it seems pretty accurate to me. Maybe you should take a history class. You know what? Add an art appreciation class too, because frankly, Hitalia has been popular for around a decade now, and I doubt a poorly done cartoon would stay along, around that long. Uh, Brian, what educational institution are you affiliated with? Oh, the, the Miskatonic <laughs> University in Arkham, Massachusetts. Oh um, my oh, god. I don't... Go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh... Nerd, nerd culture was a mistake. We need to start over. We need a culling. <laughs> purge. Hi, we need a I'm nerd purge. <laughs> a nerd purge. Yeah, nerd I'm, purge. I'm Trista Wilson. Wow, that anime is educational? Color me surprised. Every fan of Italia I've ran into has been batshit insane otherwise. <laughs> I just like the people yelling out in the chat, anime jail <laughs> in our chat. Um, one thing I'd like to, to point out about our chat and our fans uh, when you... Mm -hmm. when, yes. is that uh, anytime we, uh, we say they're not going to do something, they immediately do it. So they are <laughs> going through every possible effort to make sure that sing and rap are at exactly the same value. Yeah, I was about to mention that. <laughs> You're welcome! <laughs> yep. Thanks, guys. Love ya. <laughs> really do. Um, uh, John Toast. Mm -hmm. Make a choice. Ooh! Um, the first one is titled... <laughs> the first one is titled... They are but learners among masters. Okay. Uh, and the next one's titled... Totally like excruciatus. Oh, hmm. <laughs> Gotta go with the second one because <laughs> Harry Potter! Uh -huh. I'll be the kumquat of this episode. Okay, so we need a uh, oh, we need a girl uh, one and a girl two. So, Lou, you guys. which girl do you feel like? <laughs> girl one. Okay. <laughs> and uh, I'll take girl two. 
<laughs> okay, so this is totally like excruciatus. This is books and reading, geeks yeah. rule, all, movies and TV. Do they? They do. <laughs> <laughs> despite better, despite better alternatives. Hey, <laughs> hey, you, how did you make this document, by the way? Was was geeks rule part uh, of that? Uh, Geek's Rule is uh, an easy way to find insufferable people, yes, and uh, I did I did pull out uh, the old trick of searching the site for applause. Uh, I knew Harry it. Potter, obviously. <laughs> you do the Lord's work, Chiefskate. <laughs> Alright, so, two girls enter a bookstore. I recognize them as being two ditzy girls from my English class. Hey, girl number one and girl number two, what's up? <laughs> I didn't think you guys liked hanging out at bookshops. Uh, mm -hmm. hee -hee -hee. Duh. <laughs> Did you think that we're geeks or something? <laughs> no, do you think, do you like, wait, sorry. Do you <laughs> like, think that we're geeks or something? Uh, like, Girl. duh. I'm just looking for this book <laughs> for my sister. <laughs> <laughs> Well, said sister happens to be one of my good friends. Oh. Oh, what book does Jen want? It's uh, like <laughs> this book with some totally geeky wizards or something. Oh, you oh. mean totally geeky wizards, the manga? <laughs> <laughs> oh, do you mean Harry Potter? She's already got those books. <sighs> like, no, duh. It's like written by someone totally oldish chick named Jane or something. It's like about this chick named Emma. <sighs> Emma by Jane Austen hasn't got any wizards. I knew that Pride and Prejudice and Zombies would eventually lead to this. <laughs> Ain't Emma that witch or something? That nerdy bushy hair <laughs> one? <laughs> Ah, that's Hermione Granger. Her actress is Emma Watson. <sighs> what? Her actress ever. is Emma Watson. I'm like so totally out of here, you geek. Oh, told it. I got told. I'm stealing this book. Fuck you. You sure did. <laughs> uh, I forgot to. Uh, sorry, I'm trying to do like three things at once here. Um, so we had some more that's art fine. from uh, some more art from Lou that I brought up on the stream here from the. the... <laughs> <laughs> I really love that real story. Thanks, Cheapskate. <laughs> <laughs> They're all really good real stories. Yeah, yeah. I had, uh, and after after the stream, everyone that. applauded me. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch! I'm broadcasting from a GameStop right now. Yay! <laughs> I'm an abandoned GameStop. Yeah, we don't even have GameStop here. I don't know how I'm doing it. Somebody <laughs> played you a song on an ocarina. <laughs> Uh, so, uh, <laughs> looking through the doc, there's an awful lot of material here. Oh my goodness. It is really difficult to choose. Uh, this one here is called Get Extra Credit for Standing Up for Yourself. Oh god. So, the, the, you know, we may be getting some applause here. Oh good. So. Um, oh my me god. too. And our, our cast uh, includes uh, primarily me and teacher, uh, <laughs> but later on jock boy and random kid I've never met show up. <laughs> Well, I want to be Jack Boy. Okay. Anybody have any other claims? Okay. Uh, uh, I'll take I'll teacher. Uh, okay. Uh, Lou, you want to take me? Sure. And then Bozarth, you can be a random kid I've never met. The random kid. I've <laughs> Am I also out. reading this bracketed part at the beginning uh, yes. or is it somebody else? Yeah. Oh, boy. Okay. Yeah. Oh, good luck to you. Yay. Have Three. fun. All right. Extra credit for standing up for yourself. <laughs> <clears throat> Wait, what are your tags right. before you start? No, my tags are awesome, bad behavior, popular, and teachers. All right. Uh, the story also has a silver star on a red background. I have no idea what that means. I think that's because I'm a veteran. <laughs> <laughs> a veteran in middle school. That's right. Uh, all right. So um, I'm the highest level of math classes for my grade. <laughs> you are? Group, but, oh. yeah, I am. I am the highest level. Oh, I'm in the highest level, sorry. Oh, okay. Uh, for my grade with a group of about 15 other smart kids. Unfortunately, our teacher is one of the meanest people I've ever met. <laughs> she, seems to, she seems to have no interest in our learning and seems to genuinely dislike children. 
I live if, in a roll doll book. If, <laughs> if we have a question she refuses to answer, doles out punishments for ridiculous things, and is generally awful. My class, the smartest, most motivated <laughs> learners in the school, are failing. As a result, we need all the extra credit we can get. For whatever reason, this teacher seems to have it out for me. And when uh -oh. she comes around to collect extra credit assignments, ignores me and does not pick mine up. <laughs> despite, okay. the fact, despite the fact that, she, that, I, that it's sitting in plain view. Okay. I wait until the end of class to bring it up because she never calls my, on my raised hand throughout the entire 90-minute class period. Uh, you had your hand up for 90 minutes. Yes. My <laughs> shoulder is insanely strong. Uh, me. Jim Henson? <laughs> Uh, I get it. Uh, me. <laughs> hey, Miss Teacher, you didn't pick up my extra credit. If I didn't pick it up, it wasn't on the upper right-hand corner of your desk. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it was. I followed your instructions. There was nothing else on my desk. I need this extra credit. Maybe you wouldn't need it if you studied harder. Oh, At this point... I'm just done. I was an unpopular, quiet mouse of a girl and did not realize at the time that I actually had chemical depression. Oh, I hated oh. school, and the only thing I valued, my grades were declining because of this one teacher. No. Excuse me. <laughs> no. 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 I study hard. I study every single night. All of us do. Every single person has gotten straight minus A's in every single class until you came along. I need this extra credit because you refuse to teach. You don't answer questions. Don't explain things properly. And you're an awful teacher. My assignment was sitting on the upper, on the freaking upper right hand corner of my desk. And you walked on by it because for whatever reason, you like to bully people. You are a terrible teacher. You are failing because of you. The, the least you can do is take my freaking extra credit assignment. <laughs> And when I, when I leave this class, I'm going to the principal's office to lodge a formal complaint about you! <laughs> His truth is marching on. For once, ever, the teacher seems speechless. <laughs> For once, ever. Give it here. Brackets my name. I hand over the paper, feeling like I probably did something wrong. I intend to go through with my threat, but I'm worried the principal won't believe me, and this teacher will know and make my life H. Fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Teacher. <laughs> I leave as a final note. Let me reiterate that I was unpopular in middle school. I rarely talked, and at this time, the school is redoing the ceilings. So everyone in the hall or nearby classroom heard my yelling. I open the door and walk into the hall. <laughs> A girl said, Yeah, go, my name. You tell her. And a random kid I never met said, Adam, that's you. I didn't know you talked. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> About half the seventh grade was in the hall cheering for me. This was probably the best moment of my middle school career. The teacher in question was fired over the summer. But about, <laughs> but about half of our class fell back a year in math, which is something that we can't get back. Oh. I transferred to a more exclusive school and got mm. treatment for my chemical depression. And oh. life has been awesome. But I will always remember that terrible teacher. And the best day of middle school. I like a happy ending. Also, I, I, I'm curious to see whether or not Frank West is in a uh, boss battle. And if now would be a really good time to interrupt him. So, Hey, Frank West. Oh, God. Hi. I don't know. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> is this a boss battle? 
down. I don't think so. He doesn't do damage, and I don't seem to do damage. <laughs> oh, it's a well, great. Oh my god! Maybe he's every... a... At the he music must be a also... quest giver. Is that, what do is I... that um, like a a uh, let's say like Chili Relleno? <laughs> Down in the left hand corner there? Is that supposed to be some sort of a Mexican dish? <laughs> what yeah, sound, Frank, are those uh, ghost animals on the ground? Chili poblano. Yeah, Frank, what uh pre made oh, you what pre made oh. unity asset are you fighting now? Yeah. Also this does, thing. does this game take also, place during the uh the thirty ninth of October? <laughs> <laughs> that that's my that's my bullets. How how much bullets? Oh. Also you may you may not be hearing it. I don't know if you've unmuted We're, but uh that music is that like sick techno music is coming from the zombie. Okay, let's and it's also the let's get a bit of the, the only music, the only the music I've heard, heard all game. game. No, that's a bad idea. Am I seeing the the Death Star plans in front of you? Aha! I think I know how to beat this zombie. What? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Please, the particle those, effects. Will <laughs> those orbs are gonna get you, man? <laughs> oh my god! Please watch this. Oh, you died. Oh. Ooh! Oh my God! It's a shower. That's beautiful. <laughs> Thanks, the Fourth of July. Thanks, Frank. Yeah. You died. Uh, all right. So let's uh, let's wrap this up. Okay. Uh, we're gonna okay. find whatever's the last doc, <laughs> the last item in the document. I'm gonna paste it in the chat, and we're gonna do it. Oh God! Aren't I as good at hosting this as Lemon is? <laughs> Uh, this one's called the middle schoolers caffeine. No. <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> the middle schoolers caffeine. Um, yeah, and we, what we need here is we need a student, a mom. Um, I guess are you the student? Yes. Okay. Okay. So uh, I'll take principal. Uh, Lou, okay. do you do you want to take mom? Sure. And Adam, can I be the student? Yeah, you can be the student. Okay. My mom is the dean of students at my school, and this takes place at the beginning of the school year when it's still the rainy season. During sixth grade lunch, it starts raining too hard for anyone to go outside to play. Normally, kids would go to the gym and play, but this day they can't because of a town meeting. I'm eating lunch with my mom today. <laughs> in her office <laughs> when an angry sixth grader storms in. Oh no. Oh, I guess the, the student is somebody else. Uh, uh, John, you're the student. Oh, I'm a sixth grader. I want recess. <laughs> My mom, taken aback, tries to form a sentence. Uh, I'm sorry, honey, but you can't go into the outside. What can I do? Open the gym! I can't, sweetie. Don't f f f f f f fucking call me sweetie! <laughs> <laughs> Open the goddamn fuck, 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 fuck gym so I can have recess! <laughs> My mom, staying perfectly calm, ignores his cursing and shakes her head. I can't. There's a meeting going on in there. You'll interrupt it if you go in. Where's Mrs. Principal? She's your boss and I'll have you fired. The principal suddenly walks in, having heard the entire thing, with an angry look on her face. First of all, I'm not her boss. Second of all, Miss Mom has been very <laughs> sweet and calm towards you. Even after you started cussing, you owe her an apolog. You don't have any proof I have fuck 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 cursed. <laughs> I don't have to apologize for shit fuck fuck fuck. The student proceeds to curse his head off at both women before flashing a smug. The principal and my Turns mom. And winks to the camera. <laughs> Got him now. The principal and my mom then pull out their phones, tap their screens, and play back the kids cussing and ranting. The student smile melts. 
when it finishes, mm. and the principal then points at me. I have audio proof and an eyewitness that you were a jerk to Miss Mom, despite her being <laughs> nice, and you were cursing. Also, you are going to receive a week of out-of-school suspension. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck you! Give me my reason! The student proceeded to run out of the office. I followed him to make sure he didn't get in trouble, only to see him run into the gym with a basketball. Three seconds later, a police officer who was attending the meeting came out carrying the kid who was still cussing up a storm. The kid was suspended for two weeks and was almost charged with the disturbance of the peace. Oh by the officer, <laughs> one thousand one hundred and fifty-three thumbs up votes. <laughs> that kid's a fucking hero. Um, since we still have a little bit of time, I'm gonna throw one more in here. Ooh, yay! This one's called the Mummy's Curse. <laughs> they like puns. I here. get it. Yay! Um, the Mummy's Curse. Yeah, and this one's between uh, me, who will be played by me. And, uh, and uh, mom who... I'll take, I'll take mom. Oh my god. Uh, oh, oh, uh, robot person. Uh, Cheapskate, you are a, a, uh, a repair droid from Star Wars right now. <laughs> oh my oh, god. Yeah, you move. Whoa. You may want to disconnect and reconnect I'm, or something. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'll, uh, I can be mom. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. 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 Quest is looking at a journal right. in this game, it looks like. All right. Uh, did that fix it? Yes, it did. Yes. Oh, okay. You're better okay. now. Uh, so this is the mummy's curse. The tags are bad behavior, language. All right. Um... Okay. Here it goes. I'm in a conference with a parent of a seventh grade boy. He's very smart in math, but has the bad habit of going off, loud cursing, using the N word in reference to himself and classmates. Oh, goodness. Uh, detention helps some, but I don't want to give him any more detentions because then he would get suspended. Note: the student is with the mom during the conference. All right, I'm back. Okay. Uh, uh, can I take mom? <laughs> or did it get handed out? Uh, well, no. Yeah, uh, yeah take mom. Cheap, cheap skate, you can have mom. All right, yeah, yeah. You can be have mom, mom, please. Oh. Okay, so uh, me. A student is very smart. He's one of my best students and certainly uh, the top math student in seventh grade. He really seems to enjoy the class and always participates. However, sometimes when he gets a bit upset at his classmates, disrupting the class, he starts shouting and cursing, including use, using lots of racial slurs. He responds well to my direction to stop, usually, but I'm afraid it has become habitual. A student has such potential for his future, and it is important for him to know that this is not appropriate in a school or work environment. Will you work with him about this at home? I'll work with this little nafafafuck right now. Uh, Smacks my son in the back of the head. Don't you ever use that god fuck language in this fuck school, you dumb mother fuck-fuck-fucker! fuck I didn't take off word to hear about your black fuck acting the fool. You told me you were doing good things in in math. Lying a fuck fuck Uh... I'm so god f -f fuck mad right now, this little f -f -f fuck has worked my last nerve. I don't know where he gets this from. Nobody in my f -f 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 fuck family even curses. Rimshot. Ba -da 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 -da. <laughs> <laughs> and that was not all I was learning. Uh, I like that. Learn this, Sarah. Learning. I learned that our I, I learned that our rule about asterisks uh, really worked out well for that last time. <laughs> we really expanded modified. those rules. That rule early. It was sort of a modified rule of it that uh, that Lou set a precedent for. So now it's now it's every individual asterisk is fuck. <laughs> yeah, I learned why teachers burn out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> fair point, but not really because none of that was fucking real. So. Well, yeah, but the idea that people are fantasizing about uh, displaying all this sort of uh, obnoxious behavior uh, puts you in the mindset of people with somebody who wishes they could do this shit all the time. Like, That's it, true. Yeah, a lot of these stories, some of the ones that we didn't read, that we didn't read, uh, it, to anyone over, like, age 25, the, the teacher is the hero, and then to anybody under that age, the student is the hero. Sure. Yeah. yeah well, yeah. and I believe that one kid really fucking likes Italia, so. 
Oh God! No. Don't. Why would so? you have to bring that back up? <laughs> For you. Oh, thank you. I appreciate mm-hmm. it. Okay. By uh, the way, I want I want to point out. Uh, I want to uh, give props to uh, uh, Travis because look at these different collages Travis has got. He did a oh, yeah. great job. <laughs> oh, yeah. All this stuff happened in the GameStop. Yeah. Yeah. Travis yeah. has been doing some amazing work. He's gonna step away. We're gonna have Positronic in for the uh, for the rap battle uh, section because I see that that in the battle uh, rap is just barely eked out. Sing two hundred and eighteen dollars and thirty five cents to two hundred and eight dollars and thirty five cents. Quick feed, you still have time to fuck this up. <laughs> no, it's done. Oh my goodness, it's <laughs> at ten dollars. And it's my sh- ten dollars. Um, and my sh- my shift is over for tonight, so I will see you all tomorrow. Oh say, my hey. goodness. Say, well, say farewell to Healy's toast and cheapskate, and we're gonna Yay. bring in uh, Ifan and Portax. <laughs> we'll Ooh, be doing some bye bye. <laughs> Isn't that delightful? Awesome. <laughs> all right. Awesome. Uh, goodness, we got yep, the, Thanks for bringing me on board, it. folks. Uh, give money to the SPLC. Yeah, thanks, cheapskate. That was a great. Yes, job. Right. All right. Yeah. Later.